Hello beautiful people, it's me again. In my last vlog, you guys asked me to vlog more of my experience being here in Norway and I'm gonna do my best. I'm going to do my best to vlog and share my experience in Norway since so many of you guys are interested in what's going on. I've started taking Norwegian classes, so maybe I'll start speaking a little bit of Norsk. Yeah, I hate their Sydney. Yeah, I hate their Sydney. I also need a name. Maybe I should come up with a name for this vlog series, or maybe I don't need a name. Like, not everything needs a name, you know? But whatever. Let's just, we'll just get into it. I'm in too deep. Oh, crap. The lighting in this bathroom is not the best, but that's okay because we won't need much lighting for this anyway. So Neutrogena has asked me to be a part of the Dirty 30 Challenge. Dirty 30 Challenge. That's really hard to say five times fast. Try it. Dirty 30 Challenge. Dirty 30 Challenge. Dirty Anyway. The purpose of the challenge is to highlight the importance of double cleansing. 30% of makeup is usually left behind when you just use an ordinary cleanser. So today we're going to be doing a really fun challenge to show you guys why it's important to double cleanse. Specifically with the Neutrogena makeup wipes, my faves. This is my almost empty bag of them now. I love these wipes. So we have some UV makeup, we have a black light. It's gonna get really weird and fun and I'm very excited. Let's do it. I'm gonna go crazy with this UV makeup because this is fun. Ooh, together, together, you'll be my heart and I will love. That's almost time. We also have some UV lipstick. Let me just get this open. Okay, so here's the completed look. Now, obviously, you're probably not wearing UV makeup on your cheeks or your eyes or in general, like unless you're going to a rave or something, which rave on. But this is supposed to represent just a normal face of makeup. So now I'm gonna turn off the lights and use the black light. Very CSI detective. <laughs> I'm very excited about it. Okay, hold on. Now we're in the dark. This looks really sick. I don't want to take this off, but that's not a part of the challenge, so let's continue. Okay, so now I'm gonna wash my face using my normal face wash. Normally when you double cleanse, you want to use the makeup wipe first, but for the purpose of the challenge, we're gonna do the face wash first and then show the residue left behind and then use the makeup wipes. Now I'm just gonna wash my face like I normally would. Take my cleanser, you know. So now I've washed my face and dried it. Right now I look pretty good. Like if I washed it like this, I would think I was good to go. We're going to turn the lights off again and use the black light to see if there's any tiny traces of the UV makeup left. In the dark again. Oh, oh, what? What? I am appalled. Did I wash my face? No. Look, the blue is still just... That is so messed up. That is messed up. I cannot believe that. It looked like I didn't wash my face at all. To my eyes, my face looks clean. Wait, did I wash my face? I did, you guys saw me wash my face. I recorded myself washing my face. I, this is crazy. All right, now I'm gonna take the Neutrogena makeup wipes, which look like this. I'm just going to gently wipe over my face. Now the key with using these is being gentle, you guys. You don't wanna be like tugging and going crazy. And I already said this, but normally with double cleansing, you wanna use the makeup wipes first before the face wash, but for the purposes of this demonstration, we're doing it backwards. All right, so this is what the makeup wipe looks like after I've wiped it all off. Hopefully, there was still a lot of makeup on my face. Now we're gonna turn off the lights for the last time with the black light and See what's left. So we can see that there's still a little bit left, but going back in with that wipe definitely got rid of all of the tiny traces that were still left over, majority of them. The blue liner is its own beast. All right, guys, what have we learned from the Dirty 30 challenge? Um, that cleanser failed me miserably. Love her to death, but she can't do it all on her own, clearly. So double cleansing is a necessity. This is especially important, I bet, if you're wearing long wearing makeup, which we all are, like long lasting 24 hour makeup, that stuff probably sticks to your face for days if you're not double cleansing. Well, that was a lot of fun. Thank you so, so much to Neutrogena for sponsoring this portion of the video. I urge you guys to try the Dirty 30 Challenge yourself at home using the makeup, Neutrogena, wipes. They also have a bunch of other options depending on where you live. These are my favorite ones. These are the ones I've been using using four years. Try the Dirty 30 Challenge. Dirty 30 Challenge. Dirty 30. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm not so certain that vlogging is actually a good idea for me because I think it's gonna show you guys what a scatterbrain I actually am. Like my ADHD is really, really bad. I did take my medication today, which helps tremendously, but even, even on those days, 
Sometimes it's just out of whack. I wonder what it would be like to have a normal brain. What's it like to not have ADHD? Comment below. Comment below if you don't have ADHD. Okay, let's do some work. Oh God. Hey guys, how's it going? Say hey babe. Hello. Today we are going to go and look for places to stay. We're gonna start looking at houses that we potentially want to buy or rent. So we're going to a city called Yorkland. Mm -hmm. Yorkland. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go look at a house there today and then maybe go to the mall. Since there, it's only gonna take 33 minutes. Are we gonna be here too early? Uh, I guess we could just drive around the area and see. But yeah, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna be really early. But we're just gonna drive around the area to see. I love this song. Okay, so we've gotten to the house, but the owner or the real estate agent, whoever's showing us, isn't here yet. So we're just walking around the perimeter, checking her out. Cute little walkway. This is the side of the house. Very big yard. That'll give us a lot to do. And I think this is the guest house area over here. And this is the main house. I don't know, we gotta get inside to see what it actually looks like. But so far the outside is pretty cute. Just sitting and waiting. Sitting and waiting. Oh my gosh. This looks disgusting. What are you looking at? I'm looking at the all the information regarding the house. Hmm. The kitchen and the living or dining area. Over here is the living room. Very cute. Fireplace. Up the stairs. I actually really love the chandelier, it's so cute. Here's a little office space. So cute in here, this wallpaper. Also love the details of the walls. The crown molding on the ceilings. Same here. I love this, you don't see this in houses anymore. So cute. I have a little piano. I love this. So we are on our way to dinner for our anniversary. Yay. We're walking, um, well we're looking for the little motorized scooter things because we didn't want to drive because we both wanted to have a drink. So. And we're law abiding citizens. Um, but yeah, we're walking down the street. All right, you guys, that's it. That's, that's the end of this vlog. Thank you guys for hanging out with me. I hope that I'm vlogging all right. I'm not a vlogging girl. I do my best. She's doing her best. Tried in the past to vlog on a consistent basis, but it's just never really worked out for me that well, you know? Um, but I keep trying. Get knocked down seven times, get, get back up eight times. I don't know if that's the saying or not, but sounds inspirational enough. So let me know how I've done in the comments below. Thank you so much to Neutrogena for partnering with me for this video. Love y'all. All right, you guys, I'm gonna go. I love you. I'll see you.